tables on the floor. And that's where all the excitement's happening. So in 2025, we see the QP mini liquidity comes in from the anchor up to the core. And QP, again, meaning qualified participants. Those are the individuals that have been KYC background checked. 2026, we'll begin beta testing the QKey wallet and the fiat CDBC swap will begin. 2027, it will be the second year of Ledger Bridge that started the year before. 2028, we can expect some baby liquidity coming in um, over the bridge. 2029 will be the end of the Ledger Bridge. And then in 2030, we can expect both platforms, so Stellar Anchor, will merge into Stellar Core. So we'll be on one unified platform. And this will trigger the public RV. And that we expect that RV process to last about 10 years because the deadline and when PBFT will become active and the bridges will be burned and all fiat will be swapped, we're expecting to be in 2040. So again, for the beta taste testers, we're expecting that mini liquidity to come in between 2025 and 2029. And this is as a reward for helping beta test the system. So this is the early RV for those of us who have been beta, beta testers. And this is also where all these assets are being tokenized and bridged into Stellar from the old system. And each major piece must be beta tested. We've got to work out those kinks. And this is also where us as the QSI investors here have been helping test the wallet connect creation, the on-ramping on and on-ramping on of um, assets, the bridges, the smart contract payment algorithms, because again, this is all brand new code. And this is also where in the background, the AI, the artificial intelligence, is tracking and learning the normal, honest transactions from the blacklisted scam ones. 